Hello, my dear friends. Welcome to learn SAP FICU. Friends, today we will continue the previous topic, which is how to run BRS and check main bank balance. We are doing manual bank statement and we have completed till defined variant. In a previous video, we have completed till defined variant. We have defined a variant. So today we are going to start from manual bank statement upload. Go to SAP. Run the T code. FF67. Here. Before going to starting. First of all, you need to click on this settings, then specifications. Here you need to select your start variant, which you have defined in a previous video. That is TABAR, BRS Tata variant. We will select this variant, then continue. Then you need to select this processing type is 2, which is 4. You can see the list by pressing F4 key. 2 is for pro further processing as batch input. Select 2 here, then click on continue. Now, give your company code, that is Tata. Select your house bank, press F4 key and select your house bank. This is your house bank, SBI K1. Select your account ID, press F4 key. Select your account ID. Statement number, this is my first statement, so I am giving Suppose this is my first statement, so I am giving 0, 1. As per your statement number, you need to give. I am giving 0, 2. Statement date, so I am giving today's date. Here you need to give a opening balance and closing balance. Opening balance and closing balance, friends, we will give as per our GL account. Create new sessions as per calculation of our GL balance, bank balances. Run the T code FBL 3N to check the balance. Select your GL account. all items and continue friends here in a opening balance we have to give a balance of your main bank and in closing balance we have to give a balance as per the calculation of incoming and outgoing banks understood now go back to a gl account line item display here we will see in a main bank, I am having 20,000 credited. Amount of rupees 20,000 minus in cents, it is credit amount 20,000 minus. In closing balance, as per our transaction which we want to reconcile, according to that, we have to give a closing balance. Suppose I want to move this 
fifty thousand amount in my main bank. I want to reconcile this document, which is fifteen double zero one four. So the calculation of closing balance is minus seventy thousand. Twenty is opening balance, and fifty thousand is so the calculated amount is seventy thousand. Understood, friends? Here in our main bank, listen carefully. In our main bank, the balance amount is twenty thousand credited, and if I want to clear this document, which is fifteen double zero one four, with the amount of rupees minus fifty thousand, this this account I want to clear. So. I need to give the closing amount is minus seventy thousand. Here I need to give a posting date. I am giving today's date, and here I need to give a bank posting session session name. I need to give. So I am giving here T A zero one. I am giving here T A zero one. Press enter. Here it is a message of it is a first statement. So continue. Here I need to select the transaction bank statement line items. So transaction type here you can say it is a outgoing bank GL. It is account of outgoing bank GL, and this is our outgoing. Payment. So the transaction type which we have defined for a uh, outgoing payment is TA zero two, and here you can see the value date. It is not showing. So double click on it. Here you can see for value date is eighteen six two thousand twenty. So I am giving here eighteen six two thousand twenty, and the amount of rupees. Minus fifty thousand. Enter. Now you can see the entered amount is minus fifty thousand, and the bank amount is also closing balance is also minus fifty thousand. So it both should be match. Both should be match. Then click on this save. Now you can see the list saved. Now click on this bank statement. Under this, you can see this post. Under post, you have to click on this individual statement. Now you can see list posted. The bank reconciliation list was posted. But now we have to run this session. So you can click on this system services under services batch input then session. Either you can go through this path or you can run the T code. Here you can run the T code slash o s m thirty five. Here you can see our session name TA zero one is created. Now select this session and click on process. So it is processing. Here you need to select display errors only. Then process. It is processing. Now you can see processing of batch input session completed. So click on session overview. We'll get back.
back now refresh your screen now we'll run the t code fbl 3n and select your main bank gl i'm selecting all three gls of bank account all items then continue now here you can see the amount of rupees 50000 has transferred in a my main bank account 50000 is credited from a main bank account now you can see the opening balance which which was a 20000 we have entered now it is a 70000 with credit amount now balance is transferred of rupees 50000 and here again you can see we we'll get back so like this friend you can do the manual bank statement and check your main bank balance so i hope it is clear to all this is one more important thing is to execute the batch run p code is sn35 i have told you the thing is prerequisite of manual clearing the mandatory step is define tolerance group under the t code oba0 if you did not define this tolerance group for a gl account under the t code oba0 so it will not run it so you must define a tolerance group for a gl account under the t code oba0 just simply you have to specify the company code and save so it will continue friends if you like the video please subscribe my channel and share with your friends and if you have any query you can send me a message i will definitely help you thank you have a nice day bye bye